What's up you guys? Welcome back to another video. So today I'm gonna be doing a little clothing haul which I haven't done on my channel in a while. So I'm very, very excited for this. With spring in full swing and summer right around the corner, I thought it would be nice to just pick out some new pieces that would be fitting for those seasons. All the items I'm gonna show are from my favorite store, Princess Polly. And if you guys wanna do some shopping, you can use my code Chris for 20% off. They do free shipping on orders over $50 and they've just got the biggest variety on their site. So I love them, definitely check them out. I'll leave a link to their website as well as links to all the items I'm gonna show down below. I'll also include my sizes because I don't know sometimes it's good for reference but yeah so without further ado let's get into this spring haul let's start off with what I'm wearing right now because I have been living in this crew neck this is an oversized Looney Tunes sweatshirt it's in this nice cream color it's got the little characters I don't know I just love crew necks and obviously when I'm lounging around at home this is pretty much what I always wear the fit of this is meant to be oversized I did get this in a medium slash large and it just has the perfect hang I've also got on a pair of hoops from Princess Polly and I love these because because obviously I love gold jewelry. They're a bigger, chunkier hoop, but I like them because they've got a twisted detail, which I think adds the perfect little pizzazz to a simple outfit like what I'm wearing today. But yeah, I love these hoops. These are my new faves. Next, we have this simple white tank top, and it does have little ties on the side. So here you can see one side is tied, and then the other one you can just kind of let it hang however you want to do it. It does cinch up, so you can make it a little bit shorter. You can make it fuller length. I cannot stop with the basics. I have a lot of white tanks already, but nothing quite like this. Plain white tops, plain black tops are my most worn things in my closet, so having more never hurt anybody. <laughs> Next, we have this little mock neck top. It's a long sleeve white top. I have been on the market for a top just like this. I see people wear it in so many different ways, either layered under a crew neck or just under a coat. It's an essential layering piece for if you want to add a little extra warmth to an outfit or just to spice it up. This top, as well as pretty much every other item here, I got in a US size 6. Next we have this little cardigan sweater top and I think this is going to be perfect for the springtime because it's just a really light sweater material. In San Francisco we have warmer sunny days, we have colder foggy days and I feel like this is just the perfect piece to wear for either day. It's in a nice simple beige color as you can tell. I'm really into this color scheme. It almost looks like a pale yellow which is also very springy color. I got this in a small slash medium and yeah, I just want it to be a little bit more form-fitting. Next, we've got a little graphic tee. This one is in this beautiful green color. I am living for this color. You guys know I love my oversized tees, so when I saw this, I knew I had to get it. It just says Brooklyn, New York on the front. This is me manifesting that I'm gonna go to New York again soon. I only got to spend a day in Brooklyn, but the day that I did spend out there, it was really nice and I wanna explore it more. So, got a shirt to manifest it. This I got in a US size 8 because I wanted to make sure it's extra loose, extra baggy, and it's perfect. Normally when I shop with Princess Polly, I try my best to pick out basics that I know will go with a lot of things and will just be staples in my wardrobe. But, you know, sometimes you just gotta have fun with it and pick out things that bring you joy. And I have two tops here that do just that. This one's a little bit hard to show, but you'll see it in the try-on clip. It's pretty much like a halter top. This green is so, so pretty, and it's made out of this slinkier fabric. So, I don't know, I feel like it just looks really good in the light. Definitely feels like a dressier top, but I think for the spring, summer, you could dress it up or dress it down. We've got another top here that's very difficult to show, but again, you'll see it in the try-on clip. This is also a halter top, but like a true halter top. The color palette of this is so stinking cute. Got stripes of brown, tan, orange, coral. I think it complements my tan complexion very well. It has the tiniest bit of shimmer in the fabric, which I think is so stunning. I don't know if I've ever really talked about this on my channel, but I do have some insecurities being someone with a flatter chest. I do tend to stray away from tops that I don't think are that flattering on me or that I think look better on people with bustier, fuller chest. So this is definitely something that I think kind of does accentuate my flat chest, but also, you know what, like who cares? I still like the color, the print, everything, and I'm gonna rock it either way. So if there's something that you wanna wear, but you don't feel 100% comfortable with doing so because you're insecure about something on your body, wear what you want and rock it with confidence. Next, I have two pairs of pants, which are very similar. 
but different colors and spending a lot more time on pinterest these days looking at outfit inspo nail inspo like spring aesthetics all that sort of stuff and i feel like a lot of the outfits that i see nowadays are made up of long wide leg pants not just jeans but also trousers i've always loved that look especially on my body type being someone who's taller i feel like it really accentuates the legs so here's the first pair i actually didn't know that it would have a little bit of this sheen to it but I mean, I'm okay with it. These are very high-waisted. They come up high on my torso and come all the way down to my feet. Princess Polly is probably one of my favorite places to shop for pants and bottoms because they just fit my body type really well. I can always get a US size 6 and it's always a good fit. They look like a dressier sort of trouser, but with a simple tank and some sneakers. Oof, that's, that's a look. Practically the same pants, but in black. Actually, are these the same style? No. So these are the Amelia pants and these are the Janet pants. I'll have everything linked down below, but yeah, just a simple pair of black ones. These are so, so comfortable. I don't have to worry about any restriction on my booty, on my legs, because these are just free flowing and super sleek. Next, I picked out this fun little skirt. I feel like tennis skirts have really been popping off this year. I saw this one and it's actually a pinstriped one. Right now, I'm really into the look of like casual, but business business casual i don't even know if that's the proper word for it but like mixing very typical day-to-day -day items like normal tank tops normal crop tops with business year either prints fabrics or types of clothing i don't know i think it's just a really cool and very wearable look so that's why i did get both of those pants and yeah the skirt kind of just fits that category bottoms again i always get a us size six next we have a little t-shirt dress moment and this is just quite literally a big brown t-shirt. I still have to pair these with a pair of biker shorts underneath, but that is no problem to me. Love the color. Obviously, brown is super popular right now, too. I don't know if it's dying out yet, but I still personally like it. Browns, tans, beiges, creams. Oh, I've worn this out already. I've also slept in it, so double whammy. This one I got in a US size 6. It's meant to be oversized, so you could probably just stick with your true to size here. Like I mentioned, brown has been super popular these days, and I mean, I hope it stays for a little while longer, and even if it doesn't, I'ma still wear it. I got this beautiful leather trench coat. Oh my god, long coats, blazers have definitely been a fan favorite of mine. It just looks so good. I just feel super badass when I'm wearing it, and you can put it on top of the most basic, simple outfit, and it just elevates it to a whole nother level. So this brown jacket, it just gives me detective vibes, and also where I live, I can wear jackets pretty much all year round because it never gets to be that, that hot, so I could wear this now. I could probably wear this in the fall time, and it will still be cute. This is faux leather, and it's just in this beautiful, like, milk chocolatey color. I just want to take a bite out of this jacket. I have pretty broad shoulders, so I got this in a medium slash large. If I plan to layer this with something thicker underneath, I'll still have room and it'll still be comfortable. Next, I have some accessories to show and I threw them all in this shoe box. First off, we have a pair of shoes or sandals. I'm so excited. I think these are the perfect spring sandals. Yeah, they just look like this. They're a chunkier faux leather sandal and I live in my Birkenstocks. I have like two pairs of them. I've had them for years and I've worn the crap out of them. Sometimes I wish I could throw on my Birks with an outfit, but I feel like they really dress down an outfit, but I feel like with these, they just are gonna look so good with any outfit like these sandals with either pair of these pants and uh, they have a little platform too these are just elevated Birkenstocks also have a new pair of sunnies they came in this little sunglass protector bag which is nice these are what they look like I'll try not to get my ring light reflection in them but yeah they're just like those simple sunglasses that a lot of people have been wearing these days but I don't know it just adds the perfect little touch to any outfit there is a slight tortoise design on these so they're like dark brown black and I mean like just even wearing them on my head that's cute too I've been wanting a pair of these for a while I was just always afraid to know like what they would look like on my face since I have a slightly bigger head I don't know these earrings are so freaking cute they're basically little hearts, but they have yin yangs on them. They're just a cute dangly earrings. They even have the tiniest little rhinestones, which is adorable. I also have a set of rings, which I've already taken out of the package. I'll insert a photo of the set that I picked out. This one is probably one of my favorites because it's just a little chain ring, but it has a dangly smiley face. How cute. And last but not least, I had to pick out a swimsuit because they've got so many new ones on their site right now. This bikini is so cute. I don't know what it is about it, but I love it. Just the cutest dang thing I've ever seen. Got little fruits all over them. And and it's given me all the summer vibes. I would say it fits pretty well. I will not be doing a try on of this because these are very 
skimpy bottoms. But yeah, that is going to wrap up this haul from Princess Polly. Again, you can use my code Chris for 20% off their site. I do plan on styling and wearing all these things very, very soon. So if you want to follow me on Instagram at San Francisco, definitely go do that so you can see how I style these pieces. I'm so excited. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, please be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not already. But yes, thank you guys so much for watching. That is it for this video. I will see you guys in the next one.